Hello everyone, welcome in part 5 of this series of video tutorials about Rigucar. My name is David from digirichards.net. In this video, I would like to show you how to bake efficiently your car animations. Baking animations is really useful when you want to export, import your model and its associated animations in another 3D software or in a real-time renderer. Each time you use some interchangeable format like uh, Alembic, GLTF or Colada and uh, you import your model into another software and uh, you have some issues uh, related to the animation or the positioning of the bones, you should first bake your animations. Imagine that I have finished my animation right now and I want to export my scene using for instance the alembic format. Before doing this I would like to bake the animation. To do this I can go to pose mode by uh, pressing ctrl tab and I have to remember that in my armature the layer 16 contains the deformation bones. Deformation bones are the bones responsible for directly animated, animating your model. If I select all of them, pressing A once to deselect all and A again to select all bones, all visible bones, as only the layer 16 is activated, I have selected only the deformation bones. If I go back to object mode by pressing Control tab I can press space, choose bake action or I can press T to bring up my two shelf menu, choose animation and here I have the button bake action. So, whatever the method you use, you will have this pop-up to uh, specify additional parameters for the baking process. You have the start frame and the end frame, which is okay for me. And I've, I have all these checkboxes and I have to select all of them except the last one. The last one is for overwrite the current action. Uh, which is not necessary if I keep it unselected. Uh, Blender will create a brand new action uh, with all the keyframes uh, baked and will uh, automatically associate my, uh, my animation, my, uh, my armature with that uh, new action. And I have to remember to select pose, not object, because I want to bake an armature and the pose for each bone. Now I can click on OK. The baking process is complete. If I run my animation by pressing Alt A, I see no difference. But now the, the animation has been transferred uh, to the deformation bones, which means that all the bones in my armature are now unnecessary. So I can go to wireframe by pressing Z, go to uh, edit mode by pressing tab, and if I display all layers, in my armature and press Ctrl I to invert the selection, it means that now the selected bones are those which are not deformation bones. So they are no longer necessary and I can just delete them by pressing X and confirm. Now I have over simplified my armature. I have only nine bones remaining. And if I go back to object mode, 
and if I run my animation by pressing Alt A, you can see that the baking process has su successfully transferred all the animation into the deformation bones and now I have a really simple rig which I can export uh, using for instance Alembic. So thank you for watching and uh, bye bye!